I'm hearing that first time home buyers are discouraged. It's a hot market and they don't think that they'll ever own. My advice for them, it's absolutely possible to own a home, even in this hot market. Watch this interview I gave that will give some actionable steps on this topic. Well, my response is it's not true. You know, Henry Ford once said, if you think you can or you think you can't, you're right. I love that quote. And uh, so really the first step is to change your mindset and to think that it's possible. By doing that, that'll open up a whole new world to you. So first step that I would do is create a plan with your mortgage broker. So many people don't go to a mortgage broker until they're like completely ready to buy a home. Well, I'd, I'd suggest that you meet a mortgage broker earlier to set a plan on how you can get there. You know, what does that destination look like so that you can work backwards from there? Next, what I do is I tap into some grants that, that are out there. I mean, there's a lot of incentives out there for first time home buyers. You get a discount with land transfer tax as well, so it's less money. There, and down payments can be as low as 5% as well. So it, you may be able to get into a home faster than you think. Uh, there are also uh, options to tap into RSP savings uh, for your down payment, and then you can pay that back later, but definitely there are a lot of uh, steps that you can do, and those would be my first steps that I would, I'd recommend. Just thinking outside the box, uh, you know, you can borrow your down payment from a family member, uh, you could buy a home with a friend as well. Just make sure you're you're close with them, um, and then you can go the you can go the route of renting out rooms as well to help uh, once you get into a property to help carry the property as well. So these are some things that you can do. The next step, what I'd recommend is search outside the air, the the urban areas a little bit further north. So you can get you can get so much more for your dollar by just going a little further and commuting. There are more and more people that are doing that now, and you'd be shocked at what you can get for your dollar. So if you're willing to commute, uh, you're, you, you could buy a whole lot more home and you can get into a property sooner. The other thing is don't be afraid to pay a higher interest rate. I mean, this, this does keep a lot of buyers out because they're like, I can afford a home, but the interest rate is just, it's too high. Now, when you factor in what, what you're gonna be paying in rent compared to uh, what you'd be able to be paying a mortgage down on. So not even to mention appreciation, even if a property goes up 3% on a, on a $400,000 property, that's like $12,000 a year that uh, you're getting an appreciation in that property as well. So the mission really should be getting into the market as soon as possible. And then from there, as the market increases over time, you, your, your ability to, to refinance and, and trade up will be much easier moving forward. So, uh, you know, it's amazing if you make it your mission to get into home ownership uh, and then set a plan, you can make it happen a lot faster than you think.